Hello and welcome. I'm going to show you real quick how to freeze frame an olive. So let's assume we have a video that has a certain cool moment that you want to zoom in on, for example. Let's assume it's here. So let's cut it here once. And now we're going to drag this part over here. And since there is no feature in Olive to actually hold a frame, what you can do is you can just zoom in, go to the right once, cut it here again, and then click on this one one frame clip. Actually, I'm going to just cut it with Control X, jump to the previous cut with up arrow key, Control V to insert it. And now I'm going to right click it and go to speed duration. And I'm going to set the duration to however long I want it to be. Let's say five seconds. And OK. And OK. And if we ripple delete this empty space, it's going to freeze frame and continue onwards. But unfortunately, if we try to add keyframes to this, it doesn't work. Maybe it'll be fixed in a future version, but for now it doesn't work. The working solution currently is to right-click this and save frame as image. Give it a name and press save. Of course, you need to know where you saved it. Here is the file. I'm going to drag it in and get rid of that window. And now I'm going to move this to the side and just drag the one frame I exported in here and remove the empty space with ripple delete. And now it freezes and I can also do keyframing. So let's uh, position and scale enabled. And now we're going to zoom in. Yep, as you can see, it works. And we're going to jump to the end. Click, click, down arrow, left. And we're going to reset these to default. All right, let's try it out and whoosh time, 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 and back. I hope this helped. Check out my other very short Olive video tutorials. Leave a comment if you have any questions or need help with anything, and I will see you in the next video. Until then, ciao!